Just calm down. I will not calm down. You and I are friends, right? But if you ever go behind my back like that again, I will personally take you down. Back off, Alex. Now, I've known you since you were a low-level operative at the CIA. Do not play that card with me. You think you're above the law? You are not above the law. I didn't say I was above the law. You said just exactly that when you went behind my back with one of my agents for your own personal crusade. We needed to do something. Richard, there are channels for that kind of thing. To hell with your channels. Now, that could have taken weeks, months. Elizabeth could have been killed. You see, that's what I'm talking about. If the victim was any other American, would you have done the same thing? Yeah, I thought so. Because not everyone has Lionel Wakefield's money. So you tell me this. Why is it that you and your friends get special treatment? Like you wouldn't have done the same thing for one of your friends or daughters. Do not turn this around on me, OK? You broke the law. I saved two lives. You're sore because your toes are getting stepped on. Richard, stay away from my agents, period. Don't go there. No, this conversation is over, sir. Something is really wrong here. OK, fine, so you tell me what happened. You were in the shower, and I went upstairs to the attic, and this naked man he... Excuse me? This naked man. My mother's lover. He was in the attic, Ariel. He said, what you looking at, Ricky? And he disappeared. And I shot you. It was a mistake. And you were all bloody and dead. And I took you. And I put you in a four-foot hole. So, dirt and blisters, OK? Now, Poochie, I know things could be better between us. I'm going to make things better. When we get home, the first thing I'm going to do is chain your ass to the bathroom sink, beat on you till I get tired. How's that sound, huh? From now on, you're gonna eat your dinner out of a little freaking pie tin like the sorry ass dog that you are. <laughs> what are we doing? We're getting up a posse and go after him. Well, what posse are you with? Your posse. We ain't no posse. Well, how about you? You a posse? I ain't no posse. You a posse? I ain't no posse. Anyone around here a posse? I ain't no posse! What do we do now? We find a posse. Find a posse? Good idea. Don't be stealing my terminology. What say we branch off of here and look around? Good idea. Look around for a posse? Reckon there's one around here someplace. Reckon there's no use beating a dead horse to death. Listening to me? Do you have any idea just how powerful this man is? So? Don't be so naive. What? You and I live in the real world. <gasps> what is that supposed to mean? That is supposed to mean that you and I both know that men like Wakefield always get away with murder. 